This is your shock. Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you can see, I am wearing a hat today which I usually don't do. I just got a really nasty haircut and I don't like to show it off. Insecurity. But today, as you saw the title of this video down below, you already know what's happening. Again, this is not clickbait. I kid you not, this really happened to me. James Charles scammed me. So let me just give you the rundown before I do this. This video is to not bash James in any way. I sister stand for a real one. As you guys know, in all my videos, there's at least one sister in there at some point. Sister Santa Cloud, super sister hungry. Send me a sister smooth sister when a sister snatched my phone. I was kind of sister salty about it, but in my sister strawberries, and I just sister swallowed a strawberry. Sister strawberry. Okay, sisters, good sister selfies. <coughs> Anyways, let's get right into the story time. So sit back and relax and prepare yourself to take some sister sips of some really hot tea. So it's all started. I was on my phone, on the toilet, going through my Instagram, going through my YouTube channel, like all the feed, all the stats and everything. As I was scrolling through my Instagram, I got a random notification that James Charles friended me. I was like, mm -hmm, this is no way this is James Charles. So basically I'm on the toilet. I'm like so shook to the core. I'm like, wait, this James Charles, James, this is James Charles. Just to make sure I open the notification. On the YouTube app, you can not only watch videos and subscribe and give thumbs up to people. You can also chat with other YouTubers such as James Charles friend requesting me on YouTube. Before he was able to send any message, I was like, Sister James, I love you so, 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 so much. I love you so, sister, much. And right after I sent my messages, he sent me a link along with a long paragraph, like one of those paragraphs you get when you win a sweepstakes. It seemed very computerized and very like copy pasted from like a previous winner he probably picked. Basically, like he had picked someone from his comments and chose them as a winner for this giveaway kind of thing that I had not known of because like he had never said anything about in his channel. Like I said, I watch every single one of his videos, like and subscribe and comment every single one. So I'm not surprised. I want I really would love if he gave me a shout out so the link that he sent me was only able to open in the YouTube app So I couldn't go back in my Safari account or my internet look at my history and find out where that link was Basically what it was it was like an orange website with like a man in like a trench coat like the ones that sell you like DVDs and stuff like that as you scroll down further the man opens up his trench coat and then it says there like you have three options you can have a $25 Amazon gift card a $50 Amazon gift card or a $100 Amazon gift card and so I'm like okay obviously I want the $100 gift card and in my mind I'm like okay with this this definitely seems really sketchy the website itself does not look like any website I've ever seen and we all know whenever that happens do not click anything when you're on those kinds of websites right I was like no this is from the real James Charles which I've verified through looking at his account. So I click on the $100 Amazon gift card. It leads me to this window, still within the YouTube app. It showed me one of those things where it's like, please check this box to prove that you're not a robot. I checked the box, obviously. After from that window, still within the YouTube app, it leads me to another thing where it says, to verify that you are not a robot, please download these apps. Like, okay, I've seen these kinds of things before where you just download the app or one of the apps and it works. And so I downloaded one of the apps and it said you have one more app to download to make this work. Okay, okay, okay. So I downloaded the other app. Mind you, these apps are those kinds of apps that like give you better internet access when you're using them. So when I first opened one of the apps, the first thing it said was, obviously there was like kind of an intro kind of feel of the app. At the end of the intro, it said I had to pay $7.99 per month for this app. I was like, um, what? Then what's the point of free internet? Anyways, that happened on both apps where they wanted me to pay $7.99 per month to like, you know, start the app and, you know, use it. But being the sneaky sister I am, I was able to find the X's on the corners and exit out of that window and able to make a free account. But another thing it said was that I had to make a VPN configuration thing for each of those apps, which I had never done before. I still don't know how to do that or what that does at all. If you know what a VPN configuration is, please comment down below and tell me I need help ASAP. Once I made accounts on both apps, mind you, I did not pay or sign up to do anything on these apps. So I went back into the link and still when I went back to the page where it said to download the two apps, it told me that I still had to download the two apps. I was kind of confused because obviously I had just downloaded them. There wasn't really much you can do on the app itself. They were just servers and I didn't know how to use them or anything about a VPN configuration or anything like that. And when I read the description, there wasn't anything that told me that I had to do anything else. I was really sister shook and confused about what I was really supposed to do with those two apps and why they really were important. Obviously for probably branding and connecting with the link that he gave me. Other than that, I was like, okay, what else is supposed to happen now? Mind you, I was still on the toilet shook as 
even though I never used a chat room before maybe I could look on the computer maybe it works better on a computer but I also had to leave the house right after I got out of the bathroom for another event so I obviously couldn't use the computer right after I got out of the bathroom I had to wait until after my event by the time I got home it was really really late in the night I'm like there's no time to like check in or anything I am sister sleepy for a real one and so later on in the morning like 11 hours later since I was in the chat room with James Charles I look back at the link in my phone but the thing is his icon thing his profile pic was gone it was a blank link user instead. When I went into our chat room, his long paragraph message with the link in it, the only thing that it said was link not provided. And under his bubble, his profile picture, said user suspended so what happened all right then and there i start messaging him i was like hey sister james you sent me a link to a free gift card yesterday is there any way to like reboot it obviously the user did not respond now my thoughts that this is not obviously really james charles obviously it was probably some other user that was scamming me probably branding their own brand like the two apps that i downloaded or it could have really been james charles which i find so weird because he's so like intimate with his fans if it was really him he would have like sent a personal message along with the link but again guys this is not clickbait this is not big this actually really happened to me well that is all i have for you guys today again this video isn't the best james it didn't seem like that much of a scam but still i felt like i was kind of scammed because i could have gotten a good deal or a good gift if you guys like this video please make sure to give it a big thumbs up make sure to subscribe down below and comment down below what kind of videos you guys want me to make and i will see you guys next tuesday but boom Oh,